Hi, Noise Bridge. I'm James. I can't make the meeting today, so I decided to just post up this quick video instead, giving you an update on the event that we're trying to plan right now. The idea is that this is an event. It's happening. It's happening on March 30th. I did not want to be a person orchestrating this event. I just wanted to help make it happen, but it's okay. I've accepted that, and I'm willing to help make it happen. So basically what we're doing is we're doing a noise fund beta raiser. The idea is that it'll be a fun event and it'll raise money for noise bridge, but it'll also get people interested in having a bigger event in the future that'll raise much more money for noise bridge and be even more involved. Great. So we're talking about March 30th, 6 p.m. to 11-ish. It could be longer, but what's the point? We can just compress all that awesome into a single moment and we'll have a great time. Okay. So, it'll be donation-based at the door. You can donate if you want or not. You get inside, and right when you get in there, there will be people to welcome you into the space, and there will be tables where you can check out the brand new Zip Zine number three. You can see that. That'll be brand new and available. Mitch Altman will be there with cool electronic blinky hacky things that people can check out and get excited about circuit hacking. Maybe they'll want to go to Circuit Hacking Mondays in the future. We hope that there will be someone there to demo screen printing so people can check out screen printing, also laser cutting and the brand new vinyl cutter. Maybe we can do that in like 15 minute rotations. People can sign up and that will be happening between say 6 p.m. and 8 or 9 p.m. And then there will be food available. At this point it will be the gluten vegan free option of chips and guacamole because everybody likes chips and guacamole. And if we can then maybe we can get some cheese and some beans and stuff and make some delicious nachos for us non-vegans. Or we'll have better food than that if we can get um, say vegan hackers involved or anybody else that wants to actually cook something make a larger effort. Okay. So we got all that going on, yay, yay, yay. Uh, music would happen from maybe something like 8.30 to say 10, or 9 to 10.30. And it would all be composed of bands with homemade instruments. There's not gonna be any loud punk rock music. There's not gonna be any hard rock bands of any kind. It'll be music you can talk to, uh, music you can hack to or do whatever. It'll be fun stuff. Everybody will be welcome to participate on top of that Noise Jam will be there, and that will be run by Johnny Radio, and people are welcome to bring their own instruments and play along with any of the bands at any time. I'm assuming there's going to be, I think, two to three bands, and then also the Noise Jam Orchestra. And maybe they'll also have a table where they can show people about the Im instruments they've made. People can check them out, they can ask questions, so maybe that can be another table. And if you want to have your own table there, feel free to, at no cost just set it up. And what I'm thinking is we can take the space from the Hackatorium for the event, from the dirty shop to the windows. And we can take the tables and basically spread them out so people have somewhere to set food and things like that. And if they have uh, anything they need, will just be available in the Hackatorium space. Um, the member shelves will be conveniently blocked. We're looking to get some kind of curtain type stuff to hang over the member shelves, blocking them. The sewing table will be pushed into that entrance where you go to get into the member shelves, once again blocking them off. If anyone has a minotaur, you can stick the minotaur in there, and that should work out very nicely. And we'll have the artwork right there in the Hackatorium by the windows, which you can look at, you know, right there, with the bands playing where the sewing machine would be. Hopefully, maybe there'll be someone showing off the MakerBots too, so if you want to add your own little table, just do it. And from there, uh, somebody could assemble a press kit. If you go to the wiki link, which is located right here, you can check that out and maybe you can update it and send it out to someone. Also, maybe you guys want to discuss ordering more t-shirts for Noisebridge, which you can sell at the event, or stickers, which you can sell, I mean, for a donation or whatever. If someone wants to live stream it, I don't know anything about live stream whatsoever. I do know about recording. I'm happy to record the event. But if anybody wants to live stream it, I don't even know if we have an account. Um, if you have anything you want to discuss, I've disabled comments on the video, but feel free to look below in the description, and that'll link over to Noisebridge Discuss, where you can keep this going. There's also a link to the wiki. You can check out the flyer I just made right here. You can check out the flyer that Robert just made right here, and you can also check out the information about getting involved, which has been done so far, right here. Great. Bye.